Welcome back to another episode of Scopefield Welding. Guys, we have a little rework to do, which is an awesome training session for you guys. So we want to talk to you about the importance of making sure that when you guys are shooting your lasers, that everything is level. It's got to be level. Because what we're about to demonstrate right here, we're going to show you just what the difference between a little bit of a bubble rod in one way and then uh, and then level is all right so right now what we're gonna do we're gonna pull a measurement off of the face of that that T and I'm gonna give you the measurement not leveled and then we're gonna level it up and we're gonna show you just how much of a difference that's gonna make right if you guys are ever out in the field make sure that you're checking not only your mod level over there but you're making sure that your fitting here is level as well because sometimes these things are transported all the way across the United States and those roads can have quite a few potholes or bumps and so things can shift while they travel. So you make sure everything is level when it gets here. Yep. So we've made sure that that was level. Everything's good that way. So right here, guys, we got 18 and 9 16 Now what we're going to do, we're going to level this thing up. And that's just if you were to slap that level on the mod. Yep. Look. Okay. okay guys, and now we're at 18 and 15 sixteenths, 19 inches. So just off of that, we are like 7 sixteenths out of whack, which when we level this thing up, 7 16 is a big gap to try to weld, and you're not going to be able to weld that with stick, all right? It's going to be getting cut out. It'll pull too much. It's going to ruin everything that you're trying to do. But that's the difference between just barely being out and being level. Okay, 7 16 of an inch is a long ways. Now, as you start shooting longer and longer distances, that's going to transfer into a lot bigger measurement to where you have to start being super freaking accurate with your levels and making sure everything is spot on because if you're shooting out 20 feet and you're you know you're 16 out in this then by the time you're 20 feet out there what's that 10 16 20 16 that's an inch and an eight no it's an inch and a quarter <laughs> sorry six yeah so by the time you get out 20 feet you're an inch and a quarter out of whack which is not good. So, accuracy with your levels, making sure everything's spot on. Now, we're gonna go back into the shop, we're gonna do a little rework on this, and make sure that, hey, we got our measurements right, we gotta cut the pup off of this one, add us a pup, and then we'll come back out, finish this two inch tie-in, so. It's amazing what four layers of paper can change. Yeah. That's all that is. Yep, four layers of paper. So that's kinda how we, how we level things off, especially if you're by yourself. Just get, just bring you a piece of paper and you can fold it as many times as you got to and just stuff it up underneath this thing and, until it's level and then you can go over here and pull your measurement. It's really nice when you got another guy with you that can help 